I'm doing my take on a trifle for the Jubilee. Now, it's slightly lighter than a traditional trifle in that it hasn't got the cream or the jelly, but nevertheless it's packed full of that fruit flavour. So to start off with, I'm using about 500 grams of blueberries, which I need to get into my pan. What I'm going to do is add a little bit of sugar into that. So four tablespoons. I want that fruit to soften and release some of those lovely juices. And to help that along, I'm going to add some orange juice, but before that, I'm going to put the zest of these oranges in, which will give a slight bitterness, but that lovely citrus note. And the other one. There we go. Just get all those last bits off. And finally the juice. Squeeze us in. Now the orange juice will add another kind of flavour note, but it'll also help those blueberries break down, which is exactly what we're trying to do. And just give that a stir, just to mix it all together. And that's it. We're going to leave that to cook down until that goes that lovely deep blue purpley colour, and those blueberries start to release those natural juices. The next thing I need to do is to slice my Madeira cake. Now that's the other tip and another shortcut because I haven't made my own and it will save you a whole lot of time. So just slice that up and I'm going to use that to line my trifle dish. There you go. Next thing I need to do is to pour in the sherry, just to soak into that lovely Madeira cake. Just pour that round slowly. So all I'm going to do now is let that sponge absorb all of that wonderful sherry, then go back to the blueberries. Now they're nearly cooked down enough, and they started to soften, releasing that lovely blueberry juice. So all I need to do now is strain them through a sieve, collect that juice, and then put it back into a pan to reduce, to give us a lovely, thick, glossy blueberry syrup. So I've cooled and chilled my blueberries and the syrup, and now it's time to assemble our trifle. So, starting off with the blueberries, I'm just going to spoon those over the Madeira cake. Just spoon those on, and just sort of spread them round. And now I'm going to pour over that reduced cooking liquor. And our next layer, we're just going through the custard. So, just using the back of a spoon, just gently layer it over the top. Might have to go in a couple of times. The raspberries. So, just scatter these around. These are just going to sit on the top of that custard. Now you could be much more artistic and much more careful with your presentation of the raspberries, but for me it's one of those dishes that's much more delicious than it is pretty. And finally to finish it, I'm going to scatter over some flaked almonds. A little bit of crunch, that nutty flavour, which will go beautifully with the fruitness of that dish. And that's it. My take on a trifle for the Jubilee, which is light, fruity, delicious and perfect for the summer. <laughs>